Hello everyone, I'm Ujwal Sil, Equity Research Associate at Desvelado Advisory. We are back with another episode of Noisemaker, uh, under which we share listed companies with small market cap and showing good prospects. Uh, these, are ba- uh, these are refined on the basis of our analysis. Please note that this is not a buy or sell recommendation in any sort. For today, uh, we have shortlisted three companies. Uh, the first one is Dronachare Aerial Innovations. Second is Systematics Corporate Services and the third is Weefin Limited, uh, Weefin Solutions Limited. Now we'll start with our first company, uh, that is Dronachare Aerial Innovations. The company is basically into uh, offering high-end solutions for drone service, data processing, pilot training, and GIS training. The company derives 97% of its uh, 97% of its revenue uh, from drone training and uh, 3% of revenue from drone sales. Recently, the company secured uh, an order of 2,40,000 US dollars uh, in INR terms. It is approximately 2 crore rupees. Uh, it is from Lithuania's uh, MB Davilis, which is for uh, heavy payload drone components. The fulfillment of this order is due in 40 days. Talking about the future outlook for the company, the company is targeting a 200% increase uh, in revenue, uh, EBITDA, and paired by uh, financial year 25, uh, driven by product diversification and global expansion efforts. The company aims for a 400% growth in the number of DGCA certified drone pilot training centers, which will contribute immensely towards uh, revenue from training services. Coming to the financials of the company, uh, there is an 89% uh, growth year on year in financial 24 and uh, the margins have also improved. The EBITDA margin increased from 30% to 35% and the net pro- uh, profit margin remained at the same level uh, at 18%. Taking a look at the price chart, uh, the company's share price increased from 112.45 rupees to 159, approximately 159 rupees in a matter of one year, giving its investors a return of 42.2%. Now heading on to our second company, uh, it is Systematics Corporate Services Limited. The company was established in 1985 and it provide, basically provides investment management and uh, advisory service in the financial markets and investment solutions for a broad array of investors including FIIs, DAIs, uh, insurance company among other uh, fun, uh, financial institutions. The funds uh, are expected to support key strategic initiatives including launching two alternative investment funds expanding the uh, expanding the margin trading book enhancing wealth management and uh, strengthening uh, broking services for institutional hni and retail clients while accelerating growth in investment banking and equity capital market talking about the future outlook for the company uh, the company has also approved a stock split on 26th september 2024 coming to the financials there is a 100 percent uh, revenue growth year on year in financial year 24 uh, and the margins have also increased immensely the ebitda margin has increased from just five uh, percent to 50 percent and the net profit margins have increased from seven percent to 36 percent taking a look at the price chart the company's share price uh, went from 297 rupees to approximately 1684 1684 rupees in a period of 2 years giving a return of approximately 466% now we'll head on to the last company that we have covered uh, that is Weefin Solutions Limited this company is basically into digital lending and supply chain finance technology they provide innovative solutions to a global clientele including banks nbifis fintech companies marketplaces and corporates their user-focused data-driven products are developed by experts with extensive and banking experiences. Uh, in the past three months, the company has acquired three firms uh, for approximately uh, 400 crore rupees, including uh, Epic uh, Indify for approximately 125 crore through cra- cash and equity swap. Coming to the future outlook that we have for the company, and uh, the company basically expects to sustain robust annual growth over the next three to five years with projected revenues of uh, approximately 50 crore rupees for financial year 25 and 110 crore that is approximately double for uh, financial year 26. Weefin plans to diversify its product line uh, beyond uh, supply chain finance by adding trade finance and digital lending. They aim to offer existing clients additional products such as loan uh, loan origination systems and collection modules. The company also expects its client base and revenue to continue growing supported by new partnership and with banks and corporates. Uh, heading on to the financials, we witnessed a 77% revenue growth year on year in financial year 24 and the margins have also increased, the EBITDA margin increased from 37% to 44%. However, the net profit margin basically remained the same at 30% for the last two financial years. Uh, when we look at the price chart of the uh, company, the company's share price went from 94.7 rupees to uh, 70, uh, 701.1 uh, rupees since its listing in July this year. 
approximately we got a return of uh, 640% in a matter of 3 months so yeah that's it for today uh, also we have attached the link below if you want a more in depth analysis of the uh, stocks that we have covered today uh, rest we hope we hope you like the video uh, please share the video with your connections leave a comment below share your opinions what are your thoughts about the companies that we have selected uh, we would love to hear from you thank you